Good morning, Legends. Today we have announcements from the SSC, Student Support Team, and the SFTC rolling for you. Our directors today are myself and Lakshmi, our producer is Mandy, our studio engineers are Scott and Esther, our writers are Zach and Eric, and our coordinators are Vinci, Fiona, and Caitlin. And as always, a big thank you to the Lillian Austin Parents Association for all their help with LHS TV. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy today's announcements. Good morning, Legends. I'm Miley Wu. And I'm Ava San Agustin. And these are your morning announcements for Monday, April 8th, 2024. Starting off from the SSE and LOHS Regeneration. Hey, Legends, the SSE and LOHS Regeneration is setting up a thrift store event in support of Ocean Conservancy, an organization that's main goal is to protect our oceans from prevalent environmental issues such as pollution and climate change. If you would like to donate any clothing items, please place the items in the bins in the Grand Staircase. Collection will go up until the 12th, and the thrift store will be open on the 22nd and 23rd. And also from the student support team, exam accommodations will be moving to room 233 today and tomorrow. The library is being used for course registration during this time. Please go straight to room 233 if you have accommodations today and or Tuesday and you will be able to write your exams there. That's it from us. Now to you, Angela. Thanks, Miley. Congrats to all three Osborne handball teams on their great play over the weekend. The senior men took home the title for the seventh year in a row, while the senior woman came up three goals short in the final against Excuse the interruption. This is, uh, Mr. SPA. Jeffrey. I just wanted to talk to all students about their course selection that will be taking place today. We'll be working with the grade, current grade 11 students today to do course selection. Back to athletics. The senior men took home the title for the seventh year in a row, while the senior woman came up three goals short in the final against SPA, taking home silver. Rounding things out was the junior men with several solid games against various senior teams. And important announcements for soccer players. Tryouts begin this week. Women's are after school on Wednesday and men's are on Thursday. Weather permitting, they will be outside, but be prepared to go to the gym if necessary. Any questions, please come to the Fazette office. And now over to Kat for more. Thanks, Angela. From the Social Studies Department, Lillian Osborne has two scholarships available for SUNYA, the, sem the Seminar in the United Nations in International Affairs, which occur annually at Camp Barvenox at P near Pigeon Lake. If you are in grade 10 or 11 and interested in more details, please go to the link below. Applications for the school scholarship must be submitted by April 15th at 3.30. If you have any questions, please see Mr. McCollum in room 248 and from Ping Pong Club. If you're signed up for the table tennis tournament today at, and, or just want to cheer on friends, make sure to remember to head over to the main gym at lunch. If you are late to your match, you will be disqualified, so please make sure to show up on time. Good luck, every, everyone. That's it for me. Now over to Angela. Thank you, Kat. From the SFTC. Hey there, legends. Looking to make a difference in your community this spring? Then the SFTC invites you to join us at our monthly general meeting on Thursday, April 11th during lunch in room 154 to learn about upcoming opportunities as well as a brief update regarding our executive team next year. We hope to see you there. From the SSC, our fundraiser was moved again to this Friday, April 12th at lunch and this time the date will stay. We are selling a six pack of cinnamon buns for $12 or individual cinnamon buns for $2.50 each. 
All proceeds are going to the World Wildlife Fund to align with this month's subtopics surrounding climate change and environmentalism. The WWF aims to reduce human impact on the environment and pro promote wilderness preservation. We hope to see you there. Now, what do you have for us today in QuizWiz? Amber? Thanks, Angela. Hey there, legends. Hope you're all rested up and ready to do your daily morning quiz was made just for you. Scan that QR code as fast as you can so that you're ready to answer today's quiz was question. Before we get to it, our winners from last week's quiz was lightning round was Zoya T in room 113, and our teacher winner was Miss Wang. We'll be delivering your prizes to your Block 1 classes. And now back to Ava. Psych! Haha! <laughs> got you, legends. I know I caught you all off guard. You too, teachers. Don't worry, I didn't forget. Here's your next questions, legends. Which of the following foods is a meat stew notably seasoned with paprika commonly eaten throughout Central Europe? Was it A, goulash, B, coca vin, C, chili, or D, wonton soup? Make sure to put, it in, put in your answers before the end of Block 1 Legends. Now, Miley, Ava, you hungry? Um, personally, not anymore, because I think we just ate up that entire broadcast. <laughs> yes, Queen, and that's it for today's announcements. Check the description down below for any codes or links from today's broadcast. Don't forget to check School Zone and follow us on Instagram and X at LHS underscore legends. Remember to like, subscribe, and click that bell icon. And be sure to check out the Student Solidarity Committee's Instagram post to see the research, research on current events. Click on hashtag LOHS underscore SSC to stay up to date. And for LOHS TV, Kat H, Angela B, and Amber S, I'm Miley Wu. And I'm Ava San Augustine. And just remember, be, be legendary. legendary.